Hello, today I'm going to show you how to get games for free. Nintendo 64 games and arcade games. This is a arcade thing that goes on your laptop and it's called MAME. But in order to do this you need MAME32. So type that in and Google. Type in M -N M A M E for you to download, okay? Click that. Click search and uh, click on the first link. This will take you to a page. You have to sign up for it, but it's free. Um, once you do it, just click on the first one, and so you'll have to sign up or log in. Once you've logged in, um. What will happen is it'll, if you want to download it the fastest, like in a couple of seconds, you'll have to pay. But uh, if you scroll down to the bottom, there's some um, optional links here. They only take a minute to download anyway. So if you can afford to spend a minute of your time, just buy the quickest package. Anyway, once you have done that, in It'll, you'll get a um, you'll get a symbol, and that's an extraction thing. Okay, what you need to do is a uh, first one you download is say extract someplace, and wherever you extract it, go to that place. I extracted it to a thing. I created for called main. So there it is, it'll look like that look. And it'll be a symbol. If you got Windows XP it'd be a bit different. Double click it and I'll then extract the files and I've already done this of course. And you'll get a folder called MAME thirty two. Okay. So that's that. Inside of it will be a load of files and you think, Oh, this is gonna be really complicated, but really it's not. So only one file you need to be really concerned about and that is near the bottom and that's this one, ROMs. That's where all the games are gonna go. Now, to get the games, go back to Google search. So go back to Google and type in the game you want. First say you want a killer instinct, type in killer now, the file is called Kings, so it's K-I-N-S-T, it's Kings, and just press enter. Click on the second, uh, click on the second link, that's a zip folder, and, uh, you want to download that. Sorry, my computer's quite slow, and then click on this, download this ROM and then download the Killer Instinct, just download it straight to your desktop and uh, then you need the uh, CHD file, so in Google search just put kings.chd first enter ok, now um, you click on the uh, first, second link, sorry second link so you click on that and uh, you need a, to a bit to rent client. I recommend Azorus or bit to rent because they're quite fast. Just click download the torrent and it'll download it in bit to rent. I'm downloading a. Uh, I'm actually downloading. Uh, oh, there it is, Kings. I'm downloading the second one as we speak. But um, once you've downloaded that and it's saved. It'll just be a CHD file and it'll be located in my documents, then Azorus downloads or BitTorrent downloads. Then get the CHD folder and create a folder on your desktop called Kingst again. And uh, it should be exactly the same name as the zip folder. If it's not, then it won't work. And you drag the CHD folder into the Kingst folder you just made. Okay, so there are the two folders. Then, once you've got them both, go on MA32 again, 
M A M E thirty two. Sorry. Scroll down and find the Rams find folder. So there it is. Click on it and drag Kings here, and then drag your Kings folder you just made with the CHD file in it. Okay, and uh, that's your game really. And uh, once you've done that, click on MAME32 and it'll look like this. Now first, there'll be a lot of black squares and first of all, there's all over uh, 6,500 games. Um, none of them you have got. Well, these are all the games you can get on it, 6,500. And um, these are the games you haven't got. With the black squares, these are the ones you haven't got. If you can't find the one that you just uh, made, then click on at the side, Available Games. You see that? Available. Click on it, and there are the games that you loaded yourself. And it'll have a green, green square next to it. If it's got a green square, it shows. If it's got a black square, then um, you haven't downloaded it into MAME32. And once you've actually downloaded it, double click it and you play it. Oh, by the way, if you want to use a controller, if you click on options and then go to default game options, click on controllers and uh, Enable joystick input. Just click that, and uh, then you can actually use a joystick, like a, for example, a PlayStation 3 controller, and you can use that to play your game. Okay, so uh, I'm going to try and use that now. Okay, so you just click OK. And double click your game. Oh, if the PlayStation controller doesn't work, you can buy one for about five pounds or ten dollars if you're American. So double click Killer Instinct and then your game loads up. And if you're using the keyboard, number five is to insert credits. So, okay, and if you press one, then that's one player. Two is two players. Sorry about the drawing in my hand. Just messing about earlier at school. Um. And you choose your character with the arrows, of course. And uh, once you choose your character, press the space bar to choose. And uh, there's three, well, there's a couple of moves you have to do. I can't fight because I'm u only using one hand. One hand for the camera. The space bar to hit. You can also use this with flash, the shift, and you can use the Z key and the X key. I'd normally win this, but uh, I can't move because I'm holding the camera. But then, that is how you get games. And if you want to escape, then uh, you just press the escape key, and uh, that takes you out of your game. Back to uh, your desktop. Okay, so, I'm Luca Harshon. Hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope you too can get free games. Um, on your laptop or PC.
if you have any questions about this video, please email me, email me either on YouTube or my personal email, which is lhartshawn underscore wwe at hotmail.com. Okay, thank you. Bye-bye.